CNC Freak here with my second pickup video and this this first part's going to be from Play and Trade Video Games in Tampa. I normally don't buy a lot of stuff from them but they had a buy two get one free sale so I ended up spending quite a bit of money and I kind of just did a little video here of kind of their retro uh, gaming stuff that they had on sale. They didn't have a lot but they had some stuff I didn't have so it was kind of nice. Um, well let's get started and I'll show you what I got. The first game is Light Crusader for the Sega Genesis. It's not a really good copy, but I've got a box and a manual with no game, so this will have to suffice until I can get a better copy. The next game is Warrior of Rome. Again, it's worn a little bit at the top, but that's fine. And the last game is Arcade Classics. It has Centipede and Missile Command. I love the arcade game, so I'm sure this one's going to be fun. The next games were some uh, Game Gear games. The first one is X-Men. I'm sure that's going to be fun. I love the X-Men games. Next one is X-Men Game Master's Legacy. And the next one is Jeopardy, just a normal edition. G-Lock. Air Battle and Dragon Crystal. I think this is a role playing game. And Sonic Chaos. Don't know much about that one. And for the Game Boy Color, we got Gex 3 uh, Deep Pocket Cover. And we got a normal Game Boy game, game Boy game. This is Super RC Pro M. And back to a Game Boy Color game. This is Micro Machines V3. And this is Quirth. I think this is a shooter for the original Game Boy. Alright, I got a 1DS game, Advance Wars Days of Ruin. This is a complete copy. Uh, I got two PSP games. The first one is the Gradius Collection. I love shooters, so I'm sure this one's going to be fun. And the other one was Fat Princess uh, Fistful of Cakes. I know nothing about it, but it kind of looked interesting, so I ended up picking it up. I then got a whole bunch of Nintendo games. This is Target Renegade. I then got Stealth ATF. And just, rem just remember, all these games were buy two, get one free. So it comes out to be a pretty good deal. Um, Wrath of the Black Manta. Don't know much about it. I know I've seen it. And I, hell, I might have played it a long time ago. I got Airwolf based on the TV series because the uh, cartridge says so. I got Xenophobe. I definitely remember playing this when I was a kid. I actually enjoyed it a lot. And Star Soldier. This is a shooter. I know I've played this one before, but I must have sold my copy. And this is the last game I got. Um, it's not really a game. It's for the Bally Astrocade. It was a basic cartridge. It actually has a cassette port on it. I never uh, would imagine I'd have found that at a place like that, but I did. The next part of the video is going to be everything I got from GameStop. Um, this is Gunblade New York and LA Machine Gun, some kind of um, shooter that uses the Wii Zapper for the Wii. I got Rooms, the main building. Don't know much about that one. I got Conduit 2. I know this is some kind of shooter. I do have the uh, first one. I got Centipede Infestation. I'm sure this one's going to suck, but it is Centipede, so I decided to pick it up. I got Deadly Creatures. Um, I can thank Scott from Video Game Sellers for making me pick this one up, because I know he was on an insect um, kick. Uh, the next one is um, the Agorist War 2. Um, 
for the PlayStation 3. And this one is the Agrest War Zero, also for the PlayStation 3. I got uh, Midway Arcade Origins. Um, I was watching Crow Plays, and he recommended getting it because it's got like 30 games, arcade games on it, so I think that's going to be pretty cool. I got uh, The Last Rebellion for the PlayStation 3. All of these so far have been complete copies I got from GameStop. I normally don't buy them unless they are in the original boxes. For the PSP, I got the uh, Genesis Collection. I actually also own this for the 360 as well. Let's see. For the Wii U, I got Tank Tank Tank. I've been waiting to get wait till the price drops on this and it finally dropped down under $20, so I decided to pick it up. Let's see. For the uh, Xbox 360, I got Fist of the North Star Ken Rage uh, 2. I got the Cursed Crusade. I got uh, Dungeon Siege 3 for the 360. I also have it for the PC as well, so I decided to pick it up for the 360. I got uh, Child of Eden. I don't know much about it, but I've heard good things about it. So, yeah, like I said, I decided to pick it up. And the last item I have to show is an item I picked up from a uh, seller on Atari Age. And it is a My IDE 2 um, hard drive. It's a compact flash hard drive for my Atari 8-bit computer. Um, I've been eyeing one and somebody put one up used and I picked it up pretty cheap. And it's a pretty cool little item. It acts almost like a hard drive, loads things really fast. So it's pretty cool. This is CNC Freak signing off. Um, just wanted to say if you do enjoy my videos, please subscribe and like my videos. And thanks for watching.